right next stop, Scrantonio. Not Scrantonio, fucking Thornhurst. Thornhurstio. Wait, why are we going to Dad's house first? No, let's go Dad's first. This is not like we're gonna be over there at Dad's all day anyway. We could just, uh, oh, we're gonna go back later. I was gonna say, yeah, we could get shit ready for the fire, like go find wood and shit while it's light out and then go back later. But yeah, but I wanted to diagnose what the problem is with this car. Yeah. All right, what are we doing? First, we're dropping the transmission in mom's giant pothole of the driveway. Dropping the transmission out of the car before we start driving. All right. And then we're going to Tom, Tony. Tony! Tony! Where did the, uh, where did the drinks go? Oh, fuck. Inside. Nah, it's fine, just leave them. We'll drink them later. Get uh, we'll get crunk later. We'll get hopped up on hop hopped up on caffeine, and then we're gonna drink some beer. We're back here in Moscow, Moscow, Pennsylvania. Good old Moscow, Pennsylvania. I'm driving in Moscow. Still listening to the same band. Still listening to the same band as two years ago. two years ago when I left. Yes. Keep shot 101. Get it, boy. Get it, boy. Get it, boy. If you're at a party and uh, everyone's drinking and someone makes a joke, you make sure you get real pissed off at them about it. <laughs> Oh yeah. Is that what happened? Yeah, because yeah, everyone's drinking at the party, you know? Oh, they... but somebody got pissed off. Oh, we it. have to explain for the camera now. Yes, this is a story. Alright, tw May 25th. 25th. 2019. Tom Damiano's party. Uh, son Tony turns 21, we walk in. Oh, introduce us, hey, oh yeah. So. Happy birthday. That's the only thing we said to him and he never looked at us again. We have we didn't talk to anyone else there. So later we're the Salock family's having their uh, you know a, a rare a rare instance of bonding. <laughs> and uh, we're making we're talking about the cake because it looks good and my mom says it's someone's anniversary cake, and so Ryan starts saying, Oh, how about we take it out to them since it's their anniversary? We'll just we'll be like a cake delivery service and deliver the cake to them. And he put his hand up, or I don't know, someone eavesdropped on us. Someone thought the hand went, she's like, the, oh, you do, Well, the hand went like this, or uh, who knows. You were mocking the same thing. But anyway, so uh, Piggy Pig Pig comes over to us and starts confronting us about it all out of nowhere. And she's like, Do you have a problem with the cake? You have a problem with the cake? Uh, that's my parents' anniversary cake. Do you, do you have a problem with that? And I'm like, I'm just like, no, I take I, it out of the blue. I was like, I was like, no, I don't have a problem with the cake. I was just like, I was like saying, oh, I'll deliver the cake. We I'll were like just making a joke, carry like, it out you, there, are we, something. And are we that dumb in 2019? We don't know what jokes are. Something like that, and, and she she assumed that we were like <laughs> saying we were gonna smash the cake in someone's face, which honestly that would have been fucking hilarious if we actually did that. Like, could you imagine? What? <laughs> That would give her, that would actually give her something to fight us about, but no, she just, she just wanted to start a fight or some sort of argument. The like, funny part was, we actually did say we were going to smash the cake in their face. Oh yeah, that's totally what we were insinuating. No, wait, Samantha literally said, smash the cake in their face. But, oh, but, they shouldn't be eavesdropping on us, case closed. Bunch of weird losers. Case closed. So Bunch we, of weird we losers. We just beamed the fuck out of there right after that happened. Say goodbye to anyone? Nope. Uh, just I, Tom. And Irish, Irish goodbye that. Yeah. Irish goodbye. Well, yeah. no one wanted us to be there anyway, so. <laughs> yeah, as soon as we, we were, were all standing in the, the garage where the cake was, and as soon as that happened, like we were standing out by the door, like we started to leave. Everyone went into the garage and started eating the cake right after. 
Like right after we got out, they're like, oh, thank God they're out of there. Let's go in now. I should have blew the snot rocket on the cake. Should have. She doesn't try to make you change your last name? Yes, I'm not going to Yeah, dude, we did. Wow, this is the bridge. We used to hang out here a lot. Dude, get those birds on camera. Two birds perched right there. I can't see them with the camera. That camera's way too small. Yeah, it's just a little river. We used to like swim here and shit. Yeah. It's not deep enough. It used to be deeper. The water used to be like covering these rocks. Yeah, we used to jump off this bridge on the other side, if you want to go look at it. Yeah, we used to jump off this thing, dude. It was fun. But like I said, the water used to be a lot higher. I don't know why it's so low. It was, uh, it covered all the rocks. See those rocks down there? On the left? Those used to be completely covered. Now it's something else. Yeah. Yeah, it's nice. Shit. Yeah, she's high as shit. I knew it. How are you? I want my beer. <laughs> How are you? You gotta turn it on, dude. Reverse Wait, camera. How do I turn it on? Reverse camera. I'm capturing There's every frame and yeah, you're okay. capturing zero of them. <laughs> How and then yeah, the picture book. Oh cool, you can zoom in and out with this. <laughs> That's sick. <laughs> dude, is it taking it? You need to press the button. I did. Come on. There was a green light flashing. Do I need to press anything else? If you press the button and a green light flashes, that probably means it took the picture. Oh. My bad. How many did you take in my face? I don't know. I kept blanking it. It's fine. Oh! That what took the picture. Alright, now you gotta take it. Okay, so I have to. 
I'm trying to like just flash it. Hello. That was a picture. Yo, I got one. Oh my god, I'm blinded. That was the son of a million <laughs> sons. Holy fuck. Alright. So, we gotta hang the, the microphone from the ceiling. Because that's the only way. There's no mic stands here. So, there's there's drum stands. There's uh, cymbal stands. Like, we have duct tape. We, have to do that. we do have duct tape. Right in the B. MX in the street. Going to the town. On my crown. Feeling down on the town. And we go into downtown. Scranton, PA. It's raining. Like to see. Holy it. shit, the fire's still up a little bit. In elementary. We go to school to learn to be cool. Because we got the smarts and we go to college where you get the knowledge in the town. Alright, Ryan's broken. The fucking tree's gone! Why did Dad get rid of the tree? He loved that fucking tree. Because it got too big. Oh my goodness, I did not even notice that. Yeah, it, it wasn't that big. Damn, the tree's gone. Yeah, it was gonna start fucking moving the concrete. Foundation. Yeah. Well, he probably he know he probably saw a crack when he moved all the fucking scrap metal, and then he was like, "Well, damn, I don't want the foundation to crack on the fucking garage." Yeah, exactly. If the fucking house collapses in, he's just gonna move out here. He's gonna put the couch right here and sleep here with his computer. Oh yeah. Oh, what's up, Dylan? What's up, Andy? Here you go. Do you have anything to say to the camera? Go piss in the rain. Oh yeah, he's no. deaf. Okay, sign language. Alright, here. Film me, sign you, because I'm going to talk to you in sign language. Say something to Dylan. Dylan? Well, he only speaks sign language because he's deaf right now. That's what I got on that one. <laughs> well, damn, Dylan, I didn't get that strong feelings from you. You only wanted to lick my butthole and send me down to Keith. Oh, shit, he actually did fuck up. 